there's a layer, guys, that joins up. You, he could make that look like this from this location, right? This is where we had sands, yep. and he can come clear the whole area, and you can go take a look. Cause I'm, yeah. he's just at that area that we never got down to, Ian. So, yep. and he could carefully march right across here, even the hump above. Pull this out if you want to uncover it for the year. Yep. But if your goal is down there, then he's going to have to find a way to work over it. Right. No, I think we should just take out what's here. That's underneath dirt right now. Okay. Yep. I just want to. Yep. Good call. So, so Jassy, yes, you know, when when you whether you need the little excavator to do that, you're going to essentially get to that layer yes, as far and as much as you can, and then let them begin to get into that layer okay. and take a look. We'll push it. Because that's where, other than other than the bison, every animal I believe has come out of that layer. Right. Well, yesterday was a really nice day. We had uh, just one more day's use of the equipment, and we're dressing the site for the winter. And uh, Mark Gould let us push some more dirt up the hill, and so we worked with Jesse to to just scrape off the top of the hill looking for bones. And man, that guy is a, is a mad, magic driver of a bulldozer, and we've got really good blade runners. And we tipped over the tusk. Just tapped it and kicked it over, stopped the site, and now we're working on it. Right here, guys. Today, and the winter has come, you can see the snow's coming down pretty good on us, and uh, now it's really a race of time. We need that tusk out of the ground. We want to finish this mammoth. So the tusk that we found yesterday is sitting in with a bunch of boulders. It's actually in the glacial till, which makes it really hard to get it out. We've got to pull the boulders out. They're all kind of wedged in there. The tusk is twisted and broken. It's a beautiful tusk, it's about seven feet long, but it sort of curls its way into this really tough glacial till. And my guys are out there working in the snow and the cold, digging into this hard, muddy ground, and it's, it's a bear. And hopefully we can get this thing finished up and pulled out by today. We've got to put plaster of Paris on it, make a burlap jacket, and pull it out of the ground. You could probably use one of those track hoses to get it up and out of the, the hole. But I think this is probably the last open ground fossil we're going to pull before the season's over here.